Kamba keren uwe ini ki rio start, kamei mariang ka download iki jing don kamu ben rio. Henry, kam la ben pendap ya ka jing kwan jong u. U benai jil liu u dei u benai bengi ken mau ker pang iki sngi be ker pang jong ka mariang ka dur yau bat ki wei ki wei ki sngi, ki bangi pen pau ya ka jing iye jong i ya ki jing tau u blei sau dong jong i. Ha ka jil la jong i, buon ngi kwa iki kam pen roi sor, ya ka bha kam niat u pait ba. Henry, kam niar bengi ni kwa ben penjat ya ka mei mariang. Ha ki niki ken diat sngi. Lai i ya ka jing pen kelem iki dieng haki kat tu kat niki benta ka upper shalong na ka benta ban pen wandor iki surok ba four lane. Da ka jing temu ban pen ne ban pen wandor iki surok four lane la saki ya ka jing pen kelem iki dieng bilat ki bala yeng di kita ki pau bat spas ne le se haki kat tu kat niki benta jong ka lenti upper shalong. Ka jing pen sengau jong ki rio pait ba halor ka jing ben nuot ban pom iki niki dieng bilat ker men ka nem set a. Na ka liang u jing sang ma. Ula pen syai bana kaliang ka NHIDPL kam sim la temu ban pom lu ikiti ki din henrei en pom tang pratili henrei en pom tang pratili ki ba pentu de kalinti ya ke ni ka surok for lin bad ru ban thung bujli de pratili ki din ha ki jaka ba kam lai na kalinti for lin 2019 hyphen SHI um, slash 326 hyphen 327 data 30th of April 2021. <clears throat> uh, the due procedure was followed for the diversion of the forest land and felling of trees from the forest and non-forest areas for the purpose of the aforesaid road project. Um, this is the background. The present instance of uh, tree felling in Upper Shillong uh, has been on social media and for this also I would like to just uh, Uh, dwell upon this subject uh, being a major road project for which uh, 16.107 hectares of forest land is affected felling of trees is unavoidable however uh, care has been taken to ensure that only those standing trees which are considered absolutely necessary are permitted to be felled <coughs> the aged cryptomeria uh, japanica Uh, Japanica heritage trees along the roadside from Upper Shillong to uh, Banium, adjacent to the Eastern Air Command headquarters, have been shielded except for eight. Uh, I repeat, eight trees, including two diseased standing trees, whose felling was absolutely necessary in view of a curve and narrow space for the proposed highway. To safeguard the heritage trees, NHDCIL reduced the right of way from standard 45 to 60 meters for four laning to a bare minimum of 24 meters, with the utility provisions like water pipes, uh, water pipelines, electricity poles, etc. To reduce right of way, uh, the standard median of 2.5 meters has been reduced to a bare minimum of 0.6 meters. And in order to compensate for the loss, compensatory afforestation would be undertaken in an equivalent non-forest area provided by NHIDCL at Nong Umiang, West Khasiels, in accordance with the provisions of the Forest Conservation Act 1980. It may also be mentioned that for every single tree felled for any purpose outside the forest land, ten number of trees shall have to be planted as a compensation in order. To ensure that the environment is protected, uh, felling of trees has been carried uh, out only on one side of the existing avenue plantations adjacent to the helipad, uh, which was totally unavoidable. I'm aware that uh, there has been a, a lot of concern about the felling of trees along the um, Shillong and uh, uh, Dauki National Highway at Upper Shillong, and um, So I have a few facts about the, this whole matter, so that it will help in uh, clarifying uh, the doubts which are there and a little bit of the misinformation also. So I'll just give a brief background first. Uh, the, as we all know, the Public Works Department, the PWD, had proposed the realignment and widening of the Shillong Dauki National Highway at Upper Shillong through the Upper Shillong Protected Forest. The total affected forest area for diversion 
under the Forest Conservation Act of 1980 under section um, oh sorry 1980 was 16.107 hectares this is inclusive of 15.296 hectares within the protected forest and 0. Uh, so I uh, don't have the exact number of trees will be fell but these are not these uh, heritage trees that we are talking about and uh, those are uh, you know trees nonetheless and uh, for us even one tree is very valuable uh, which is why we are going to have compensatory afforestation uh, in the uh, forest reserve um, <clears throat> but uh, uh, you know I don't have the exact number of trees but I think that the uh, main uh, concern of the citizens uh, who have raised this matter are regarding those uh, very old uh, cryptomeria japanica trees uh, which uh, uh, I think is for lack of information that people think that the entire row is going to be cut that is not true only eight of those trees um, because it's unavoidable we will have to uh, cut them down. but only eight of those trees are being cut and uh, as I said, the uh, compensatory afforestation will be taking place, uh, you know, so that we will, uh, uh, you know, in an equivalent non-forest area at Nong Umia in West Khasi Hills. Uh, one is to one, in uh, according to the Forest Conservation Act in a forest area. So those who are falling in the forest area, so one tree cut from forest area means one tree there. For non-forest area, one tree cut means you have to compensate with ten trees. You know, a um, lot of people uh, have that concern that the entire row of these uh, Cryptomeria Japanica trees, these uh, which uh, provide this heritage tree line, uh, are going to be felled. Um, so I would like to allay that fear and say that uh, due to unavoidable uh, you know, circumstances, we have to fell only eight number of those trees. Uh, and uh, there are two which are diseased as I have mentioned so these two diseased trees along with these eight will have to be felled but um, we are uh, very very conscious about the fact that these uh, whatever trees are being felled we have to compensate that and for that uh, the compensatory afforestation, afforestation will be taking place and uh, uh, you know the government is very very uh, very concerned about this uh, and we are always very um, uh, mindful of the fact that uh, trees uh, are very important. That's why the right of way requirement also has been reduced and NHIDCL has been uh, very, very uh, cooperative to ensure that uh, that standard 45 to 60 meters from the median has been reduced to 24 meters.